You already know, man. It's your boy King Myers. Long Island. Strong Island. We are right now. We in the loop, man. Shout out to my boy A. Shout out to my boy B Loud. Shout out to DJ Vaughn. We in the loop. Whole town know that I'm the man. Yeah, I am. If anybody wonder where I'm at, here I am. I'm hot, so they gon' hate on me no matter where I am. No matter where I am, I'm the man, yeah I am, yeah I am Couple niggas tryna take my spot, taking shots So I'ma shoot back, nigga, cause I'm all I got I'm king, so they gon' hate on me no matter where I am No matter where I am, I'm the man, yeah I am, yeah I am time I let them know that I'm the man, they questioning who I am I ain't nothing to fuck with, that's third the Wooda clan When I'm buzzing, they praising me like I'm Buddha At time I be sounding like I'm the jeweler With my foot up in the game, I'm the ruler Kinda sewer when it come to music That mean I know what I'm I'm doing, I never just do it Unless Nike was my sponsor Gave me like a million to conquer And gave me new kicks for every concert Top tired of reaching out to niggas And thinking they ready, they jealous that shit is petty I'm stacking up the fatty My grind slow and steady Y'all rap niggas buns and I'm so sincere When I spit like belly It's cold in these streets, guess it's time to pack heat Not a shooter, but ain't about to have him shooting at me Catch me in black Tim's in the all black tee In this white man's world I guess I'm the black sheep. Black sheep. Oh, okay. I know that I'm the man, yeah I am. If anybody wonder where I'm at, here yeah, I am. I'm hot, so they gon' hate on me no matter where I am. No matter where I am, I'm the man, yeah I am, yeah I am. Couple niggas tryna take my spot, taking shots. So I'ma shoot back, nigga, cause I'm all I got. I'm king, so they gon' hate on me no matter where I am. No matter where I am, I'm the man, yeah I am. Radio Yak Radio.com. Like we promised y'all, we got our second guest in here in the building from the 631. It's the 61 Invasion. Strong Allen is here. We from Strong Allen. Our next guest is from Strong Allen. Wine Dance, Crime Dance. Y'all know what it is. We got the home with King Myers in the building. Okay. It's good, bro. You already know what's good, man. I'm chilling. We all good, you know? It's a nice, nice Sunday night, another day. No doubt, no doubt. You know? No doubt. Oh, yeah, um, Long Island, what's up? Exactly. Long Island is heavy. That's up. You know, we out here moving. It's, it's a movement out here. Um, but, you know, always start the interviews off. It's like an essay. You know what I mean? We start off with a little intro. Mm -hmm. Then we get to the body. Then we got to the conclusion. You know? <laughs> You two for two today, man. For two for two? Yeah, you two for two, Bad man. Bad a thousand. I'm trying. That's a new game. Um, King Myers. How did you get this name, King Myers? Let the people know. How I got the got name. The crown on your hand. I kind of crowned myself. Okay. You know what I'm saying? All right. Call myself a king. Mm-hmm. Just off the strength of what is a king? What is a king? What do you think of when you hear the word king? What what comes to your head? Yeah, royalty, running Wait, things, top of the line, exactly. top of the full chain. Mm -hmm. You know, but still got that control, got the control, and still got the power to change shit. And that's the whole lane. You know what I'm saying? Change. That's that's what we're doing right now. So and it's so I'm laying it all out on the table right now, from the beginning to wherever we go. Mm -hmm. you know? Alright, so you're a king. What's your what's your kingdom? My kingdom? Yeah. Wherever I'm at. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's what's up. That's definitely what's up, man. <laughs> nah, you're that. He said, where we at? Hey, that means yeah. he wanted to hear, uh, what kind of kid they call that? Uh, tal not talentarian? What does it go like? One and all, everywhere? Oh, uh, talentarian. So, yeah, talentarian, right? Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> you go. paying attention, man. Yeah, no doubt. I, would just, I listen to some studies, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> but, nah, uh, so, you grew up in Wine Dance. Uh, well, did, yo, actually, this is, let me, I'll tell y'all a little background. Yeah, yeah, let us have it, let us know. I'll see you a little bit. I came up, <laughs> came up in a lot of places, man. I went, I'm from Long Island, born mm -hmm. West Side Okay. This same hospital. Okay. Was home of a lot of people, you know. But, went to school in Wyandage, elementary school. Moved to NC with my mom's for a couple years. Okay. Lived in Durham. Okay. In Raleigh. Moved back to New York, lived upstate, Kingston, Damn. near Albany, all yeah, of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it all come back to Long Island. That's, that's yeah. home. That's where we at right now, you know? But that's a little background, but <laughs> why dance Strong Island? Why dance is why I was getting my diapers changed at. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> all right, most definitely, man. And, um, like you said, you grew up in Wine Dance. So how old were you when you moved away from Wine Dance the first time? Um, I was in fourth grade, mm -hmm. about nine years old. Yeah, you got like a good nine, ten. 
If I start at school late, something like that, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and now I hear that, so at that time, I understand that you won the poetry contest, correct? Yeah, 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 definitely. It was on some... It was a surprise. Like I wasn't even I wasn't even rapping then. Yeah. I was rapping but I wasn't rapping, you know what I'm saying? I was just kinda of flowing. That's where the that's where the wordplay came in and, and the whole structure of everything I do right now. You know, just where it all started at the pit, you know? So that so is that when you knew that rapping is the something that you knew you were nice at like yo, damn. It wasn't even that I knew I was nice. Or anything like I just I knew I I was able to do it. It wasn't even rapping like I knew I was able to play with words. Yeah, it was something that we were just doing class for the, for a grade. Like it was just another part of the class, and I was just good at it. Mm -hmm. But it just so happened to be that I got family that's in the music. Like I'm around music, then, you know what I'm saying? It just and where I'm from at the end of the day. So once you start to learn about stuff, you start to get interested, and then it all starts. You know. I most definitely. You remember what that first poem was about that you wrote, or the one that came that came in second place, right? No, it was a lot of them. I just remember the I remember the event of me. You know, I, don't remember, I don't know exactly which one it is because I didn't even know she submitted it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But so I just proud. know that I got an award for it. That's where the first award came from, right there. That's where it all started. After that, I kept winning. And you said you got family members um, that was close to the uh, music industry, correct? Yeah. So your father, um, he has like a um, connection in the industry. Mm -hmm. All right, so how, how, what type of um, connection did your father have? Rock Kim. Mm -hmm. It was like, ah. like brothers, you know okay. what I'm saying? And even even past him, like his brother mm -hmm. grew up with a lot of people. Like I always heard stories from my grandmother, everybody. Like my grandmother used to babysit Flavor Flav. Oh, get out of here. You know, so that was like an even crazier story. And then one day I went to a show, I went to mm -hmm. one of Rock's shows, Rock the Bells, met Flavor Flav. All right, mm -hmm. and, and you just tell you just telling stories from there. We was all on the tour bus, everything. What? Just telling stories. Just I was just soaking it all in. You know yeah. What I'm saying? Well, that was how was that? And being backstage at such a young age, meeting all of these people. Um, what type of atmosphere was it? It became. It went from me being the first time. It was like on some starstruck because I was a little kid. <laughs> yeah. But then it just went to it being something that it's like all right, I'm here now. Mm -hmm. Like I'm here again. It was just something that was already around. It was just I just got used to it. You know what I'm saying? Just like when you come here, you're used to it. Like this is like your second, third living room, or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. You're used to it. You don't feel no different when you get here. You feel probably feel better when you get here. You know? <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. You right. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So most definitely, man. And um, meeting all of these people and having all of these people behind you. Did you feel any type of pressure to uh, perform and actually live up to these standards that they Yo, set for you? That's a common question right there. <laughs> nah, of course I feel pressured though, you know, cause I, cause people look at you, they look past you and mm -hmm. see what who will, who was already there, right. you know, who already set the stone. So when you doing the same thing, when you trying to do the same thing somebody else already did and do it better, of course it's gonna be pressure, cause you gonna wanna they gonna be looking at you to be there or better. Like you gotta live up to how good this person right. was. You know what I'm saying? So. At the end of the day, I'm just trying to be the best at whatever I'm doing. If I do it better than anybody else, then that's what it is at the end of the day. But as long as I got the people who I'm making the music for, the people I make the music for is the people who are listening. You know what I'm saying? I don't make music for people who don't listen to it because why do you make music? For it to be listened to. So whoever listening, that's that's why that's why I go with it. That's why I make the music at the end of the day. And for myself, because I like it, but it's, it's past that, it's bigger than that, you know what I'm saying? Now, I mean, those are some heavy, big, gigantic shoes to fill. <laughs> Rock him. Because he's obviously one of the greatest rappers ever. He's in a lot of people's top five. You know, he can kind of get overpassed now with these new he's rappers. He's in a lot of people's top five, and he's not in a lot of people. Right, he's but. not. I'm saying, but the new people don't really know about him. People a little older would throw Rock him in their top five. These young cats nowadays wouldn't put Rock him in their top five, but cats, you know. I'm gonna say 30 and older. He, he, he definitely he put my camera in the long Just right. from, yeah, just just off of what he did. You know what I'm saying? He put it down. You know. That's it. So what was some of the advice that you got from Rakim while you trying to navigate through this um these waters of this rap industry? On the real, I don't give too much advice because I don't ask too many questions. <laughs> you know, I just, I watch and I sit back and I try to figure some stuff out on my own and then I. If I feel like I need to ask a question, I ask a question. But every time, every time I see him, it's always some um, like like what I got to know. He just want to hear what I got to know. You know what I'm saying? And then he 
he he he asked me what I want to do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I just feel like I'm work. I'm working right now, so I don't want to do nothing too crazy right now. Right. You know what I'm saying? I need to <laughs> I need to be at that crazy point to do something crazy, cause then I'm gonna just be sitting up here. You know what I'm saying? But what am I doing? So I, I feel like I gotta still build myself up. I could, I. That's the gate right there. If anybody want to say if that if that could be the gate, but I ain't ready to. I don't think I'm ready to go do that gate yet. Mm -hmm. I want to build. I'm trying to build what he built. You know what I'm saying? Right. Or even bigger, like it's I need to see. Yeah. Before I get there, I don't want to be placed there. You know what I'm saying? I need to get there. Most that. definitely. And you're definitely showing people that you're willing to do that. Because I read somewhere that, um, like in North Carolina, when you was down in North Carolina, they say that you built your own studio. You would um, take money that you saved up, that, you know, extra money yeah, that you had. And just, and from you going, studio. just from going to the studio. I go, uh -huh. started going to the studio, seeing everything they had in the studio, seeing how the studio worked. Then started doing a little research, see everything in the studio ain't hard to get, everything in the studio ain't hard to use, started getting it. Started using it, like I do all my own artwork. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. songs that that y'all was just playing, I mm -hmm. recorded that right at my crib, mixed it on my own, mastered it, and I just this, this is what I do. Like I feel like if you want, you gotta have some kind of, you gotta be able to use the tool if you're gonna be using the tool. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta know how to do what you're doing if you're gonna be doing it. You know? Most definitely, man. Now you were at the Iron Strong Island Awards last week. You performed. And you actually took home an award mm -hmm. for best video. <laughs> video of the year. Appreciate it. For the change. Congratulations on that. Yeah, I definitely. I, yo, the crazy thing about it, once I got that award, I had a feeling I was going to win something mm -hmm. just being that I was nominated, but I felt like that was a W right there, like just getting nominated. I, I felt right, like I exactly. already, already won. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Then once I got the award, it was just like check mark. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> just like another up. confirmation. Cause when I was in North Carolina, I had the Carolina Music Awards. I okay. got I got nominated for best male rapper and I got nominated for best youth artist. I was like 16. Oh wow. 17, right before I moved back out here. Yeah. And I won. Best youth artist. I got the, my grandma got the award right on her dresser. So you the, building your legacy. Yeah, I got I already got statues. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to Definitely. get to I'm trying to get to the to the to the VMAs to the to the Grammy, you know what I'm saying? A Grammy is up there. All these awards, I look at all these awards as the same at the end of the day. It's all a it's all a, a symbol of showing you that you did something good. You know what I'm saying? So whether it's an I Am Strong Island Award or whether it's a hip hop award, it's the same shit. You know what I'm saying? I look at it at the same shit. Like even being here, this how 97 in me right now. Yeah, yeah, we, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we <laughs> yeah, most definitely. And in your music, I see that you can look at what's going on and actually incorporate that into your uh, music. A couple years back, you had a song called, um, what was that, the, the Silly Band? The Silly Band Anthem? Yeah, that was, I did that when I was, I know, like, listen, this is, this is how the story, this is how that, yeah. that song came together, right? I was in like the seventh grade. <laughs> Did this song just based off of me seeing how big of an impact it had. So I just made a song about it, like, yo, they they niggas ain't wearing jewelry right now. Niggas is really running around here wearing silly bins. And I was <laughs> and I was down south. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm I was down south at the moment, so I kind of used it. I used the um, I used that sound, and I threw my flow on it. Made the song about the silly bins, and when I dropped it. It had like 150,000 hits on YouTube. The mm. owner of Silly Bands contacted me on Facebook. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, that ass and was like, yo, maybe we could we could either work out some kind of licensing or you have to change the name of the song. Cause <laughs> it was out there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So he en ended up bad business, ended up getting done, ended up taking the video down, he ended up paying somebody else to do a silly bands anthem and mm -hmm. It was, that was just it. But that's how that came about. I just ended up writing a song about it and it happened and then like I, I went to shits, man, with silly bands. <laughs> a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, wow, yeah, yeah. I remember. Yeah, it was one it was another epidemic. You know? <laughs> some some trend shit, just another little trend. It's yeah. like how niggas used to wear niggas was putting together rubber bands, make chains and yeah, shit. Exactly. Yeah, I remember that, yeah. <laughs> Color yeah, rubber bands. When we was growing up, they used to take the lemon for you. And put it yeah, in your mouth, exactly. you know what I mean? Yeah. It used to be gold teeth. Nah, right, if they would have made something like that. They would have put something like that in stores, niggas would have been buying it. Yeah, they would have been buying it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Everybody yeah, exactly. yeah, exactly. follow the trend. <laughs> uh, now, that song, that video changed. We had um, Rock Him in the video. Mm -hmm. 
and you had Eric Sherman in the video. You know, how did that come about? Did they approach you? Trip down south and came up. <laughs> that wasn't even supposed to happen. <laughs> Yo. It's like, look, certain things don't change. They all remain the same, they all plan. They ain't trying to change the game, I'm just saying. It's time for some things to change, cause right now everything the same. Certain things don't change. They all remain the same, they all plan. They ain't trying to change the game, I'm just saying. Looking up to certain niggas for anything Cause certain niggas ain't really worth anything New year, new jewels, new grind, new rules I'm in control like voodoo, I'm big dog, you poodle I got a way to get whatever I want, whenever I want And nigga, I stunt, I ain't got a front for a nigga Talking about the heart of a lion, got the heart of a winner Not a killer, but I kill you if what you got is my dinner Cake, so called real, but deep down they fake When I'm down, they not around, and when I'm up, they hate Wait, this rap shit is water, I'm I'ma spit a lake, gorilla men with the bait, till they part of my plate. One man rule the world, one man coalition, nobody can stop me. I'm immune to prohibition, right now I'm wondering why all these niggas bitching. If your chick in my room, then all the clothes missing. I keep it a Benjamin, I'm just being frank with you. She look like a bag of money, but she bought the bank with her. Me, I'm still the same, just a few things change. Couple dollars to my name, bitches hollering my name. Pick a dollar over fame, if the price is right. And if you cooking up, make sure the spice is right, alright? They told me that I couldn't, but I just did. And I don't make mistakes in life, I Certain just Certain things plan. don't change. change. They all change. remain the same, they all plan. plan. They ain't trying to change the game, I'm just saying. Change. It's time change. for some things to change, cause right now everything the same. Certain things don't change. Nah. They all nah. remain the same, they all plan. They ain't trying to change the game, I'm just saying. Change. It's time change. for some things to change, cause right now Thing the same. Ooh, you them. This is what happened. Rod was original. We was for that whole song. I have a song with Rock Kim. It's called mm -hmm. This Thing Called Life. We was originally supposed to be doing a video to that. We were going. We was remixing it. Yeah. But we didn't get certain a certain part of the song finished in time for us to do the video. So we had already we had already made the video shoot like an event. Like it wasn't a private video shoot. We didn't. Keep it in our circle, like we started promoting it like it was like it was a party or something. Just so everybody in the hood could come in and be a part of the video. Mm -hmm. Especially since Rob from the hood, I'm from the hood, but you know what I'm saying? It's kinda like a giving back thing to the hood. Right. So and, that, and I saw y'all kept it a stack, like you kept it, you know, it was right in the hood, straight yeah, back, right you there, right, 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 King Mike, it's another day in the life of the hood. This is regular shit. We ain't going sugarcoat. Got right? the little kids out there and anything. Everything. Little kids. <laughs> yo, they more hood than a lot of people out there. We had to have them out there. The kid, <laughs> yo, that's another thing. That's another thing I do it for the kids. Yo, the kids look up to me like, they and they understand everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, they understand that I'm not famous. They understand that I'm doing it and I'm, they see where I'm at. Like, when that, my video got put on BET, Mm -hmm. The change video got put on BET, yeah. and the, the kids that was in the video seeing themselves on TV, oh, like shit. that made me feel good. You know what I'm saying? Like I did something for them. Now, the, when you when you got that call that your video made BET, what I was going through get, your mind? This was this is what happened with that, right? I got an email from BET. Okay. Then they emailed me like a week before and told me the date and the times that it was going to be aired. Mm -hmm. I cried. <laughs> uh, I cry right there. I'm like, yo, that's crazy. Cause it's like I made it happen myself. I did it. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like I still got ways to go, but I know how to do it now. Like I'm, I, I know how to do what a label could do for me. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So that's like something. That's another thing that I don't gotta look for nobody else to do for myself. That's like another thing on the list of me knowing how to do what I do. You know what I'm saying? So I'm. That's what I mean when I'm building my legacy. Like I ain't trying to sign nothing. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to sign. If anything, I'm gonna sign myself. I want to get myself a million dollars. You know what I'm saying? No doubt. That's how I want to do it. <laughs> now I hear that. You listen to Enzo Radio Yakrilla.com. We chopping it up with the homie from Six Three One Wine Dance. Mm -hmm. King Myers himself is going out. What's up, man? We here, man. We been here. We just gotta get back out there. Let's make it happen. <laughs> <laughs>
most definitely. And uh, another video I saw of yours is uh, Stressed, um, which is an excellent song. Um, and I want to ask you, um, how do you feel that you connect with your audience? Like, um, you know, like how do you go about connecting with your audience? Because you're bringing up heavy topics in that song. Um, how did that song come about? And, you know, how do you connect with your audience? Yeah, 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 yeah. They don't even know what happened. All they know is I'm rapping. They don't even know the hat. They don't even know the math. They don't even ask. They make asses out of themselves. Assuming everything is all well. Assuming everything is okay. I'ma play 50 while I drink rose. Or I might drink some rock to feel like Diddy. Some motivation. Some hoes is waiting. Some hoes is patient. Some hoes is fat. Them hoes is flagrant. I'm a young nigga, but at times I wonder where my young age went. So stressed out that I'm aging. Quick, fast like Caucasians. I'm at a point in my life where I no longer see the people. People that were right there, right by my side when I was right there. I thought 2013 was the right year. Still a star, cause I was born in light year. Feeling like my time only come every now and then. You can count me in. Long as getting money involved, my nigga don't doubt me then. I got a door that I need to be fed. I got a way that need to be led. Got points that need to be proven. Got lights that seem to be red. But I'm still gon' go, still gon' flow. Always thinking about what's next. If you thinking about me, then you thinking about the stress. Nigga, stress. Every day I'm stressed. I'm stressed, 8 o'clock I'm stressed I've been trying to get this money Living life in debt Think about my daughter She gon' need the best I said every day I'm stressed Wake up and I'm stressed 8 o'clock I'm stressed Thinking about what's next I've been trying to get this money I've been living life in debt I've been thinking about my daughter She gon' need the best I said every day I'm stressed Most of the songs, well all of the songs I write man I feel like I can't write a, a song while I'm lying. Like, I can't, I, I can't rap about something that I'm not doing. If only way I could do that, and I did it before, I got a song called Black Billy. I wrote it like it was a dream, like I, like I had a dream about, and it was about everything that I didn't have. <laughs> Just like how everybody else rap, like they rapping yeah. about everything that they don't got, yeah, like they got it. it. I was the way I rapped about it. I rapped about it like I had it. But it was a dream. Like niggas is really dreaming. I'm rapping. I'm letting it be known that I'm dreaming. You niggas is trying to make it look like you're doing something you're not. I am right. Man. So that's how I. That's the only way I can do it. Basically saying everything I write is is, is what I'm living, what I go through, what I see in the hood. Mm -hmm. It's real shit. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, that's what it all boils down to. It's just real shit. Yeah, that. Yeah, that. Now, um, you got, I see that you do a lot of live performances. You know, so what can people expect when they come see a King Myers performance? Well, of course, what you, what you think you can expect when you come see a King Myers performance? Of course, <laughs> you're gonna hear, you're gonna hear bars, you're gonna hear the lyrics, you're gonna, you're gonna see me connecting directly with you. I'm live and direct. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna see that I'm not afraid to be on stage. I'm not afraid to be in front of a thousand people or what. 50,000, however many people out there. If there's one person out there, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be doing the same thing. So you gonna get the you gonna get the show. You gonna get what you came for. It's a, it's a live performance. You want it? It's a song you never heard. A song you might have heard, but you here to you here to see the performance. So at the end of the day, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna perform. All right, it's going down. Most definitely. You talk a lot about where you want to be and what you want to have. Let the people know exactly where it is you want to be and exactly what you want to have. I don't even have a set point. Like I just look at it like. I want to be good to the point where everybody around me don't got to worry about it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And that's living life. So we, we all could live life. We all could say, all right, one day I want to go. We want to go to Italy. Everything at the crib, good. Everybody else, crib, good. Ain't nobody got nothing to worry about. We'll go to Italy. Shit like that. That's how I wanted to be like. I don't want ten million dollars. You know what I'm saying? Okay, what if ten million dollars can't do that? What if ten million dollars is not enough for us to be able to say shit is good at the crib? Like, however much it take for everything to be good, then that's what I want to be. And still have and still have shit happening with the music. My excuse my excuse my language. Nah, you can curse, man. Be a hundred percent too, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, this, that's the realness coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and I seen you, man. You pulled up to the awards <laughs> with two women, man. I was like, who this cat oh, coming up in here with the, see with, me. With, ah. with, with, with the woman? I'm like, that's what's <laughs> up, baby. <laughs> what's, what's going on with that, man? 
Nah, that was just so right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nah, but I pulled up with my girl, man. Oh, okay. With my girl and her sister. You know, kept oh, it real. Right. I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't come out and try to bag nothing. I came out. It's the family right here. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I came out how, was, how, was, how I'm living right now. That's how I'm living. It just so happened to be some beautiful women. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, roll with that, man. You know? Definitely a good look, man. Now your queen with you, ain't nothing wrong yeah, with that at all. You know, every king be the queen, right? Word. Because <laughs> <laughs> niggas loud, bro. Man, niggas be lying. <laughs> now, you just recently had a birthday. Happy belated birthday. Yeah, it man. It was on New Year's Eve, I'm correct, last right? Last day of the year. It's last like God saved the best for the last, bro. <laughs> Sound good, man. Sound good. Yo, we ain't got to save everything, man. Right? You're in the seat. Nah, that's, that's real. It all come together now, right? It all so, come together. So, how'd you bring in the, um, your birthday and the New Year? I went to Mix and Hop Up. Mm -hmm. Okay. The girl that y'all seen when we worked there. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we ended up going there, popped two bottles, kept it straight, chilled, drunk all the liquor and left. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I see you got the handy too, man. Yeah, he keep it on deck. <laughs> he ain't yeah, yeah, responsible. He on deck. Rakim got an um, endorsement with uh, Henny, right? He do? I think so. I think I know, I'm saying, I know, I know Nas do. I think both of them do, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't I ain't never seen that. But if you do shout shout him out, Henny make the moves. Henny make the moves. Tell us about 631. The joint? The joint, yeah. 631. Yo, that's that song. I was supposed I was trying to make it bigger than what it was, like how I did it, 631. I was trying to get couple more people on there but I just felt like I didn't want to wait any longer you know what I'm saying like I wanted to just something to put it out there and then for future references we could maybe do we could feature a couple more people but that joint I just wanted it to you know just let people know where I'm from yeah why I did 631 Long Island you know, just to kind of put a little spotlight on it and I was trying to make a little anthem type joint you know what I'm saying just something that people could really relate to another yeah. one of them joints you know okay Okay, you got some? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I gotta hear, I gotta know, how does this collab will come with you and Dave East? Because I'm feeling the song. I saw the video. Yeah, that's all crazy. The shit is tough. And, he, and Dave East, he actually mentioned my hood in, in, the, uh, in the song. Him say, I'm like, all right. Yeah. You know, like, all right. Live, man. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Yeah. I just do what I do. Long Island, what's up? What's up? Huh? Yeah. Feeling good right now, man. For real, I just do what I do. Yeah, uh, 20 years on this earth and I'm still going. Yeah, since it's a doggy dog world, I'm 140 and drinking 40s. Uh, I'd rather chase blue strips than new check hat. New money, new problems. Okay. About to cop a new whip, yeah. just like I'm the master. Back on some slave shit. All black, everything. Never been racist. What? Niggas take shots all day on some hate shit. They just like the paparazzi take shots and take pics. Same cats talking about you when you ain't around. Be the same cats trying to be down when you in town. It's funny. They frown when they think about you fake shit. But when they see you, all they doing is smiling like they just got him a facelift. Bro. See, I believe in good karma. I'm a gardener. I sow the seeds so my money grow way farther. For the money, I drive from one dance to Harlem. Yeah, often. And blow it back to Islam. Like I'm gonna go either way, so I'm a step <laughs> Like the king approach me with only green I'm a different breed So they pay me before I show up Drop fish scale in some water and watch it blow up Raw shit connect from DR It ain't got no cut Took a trip to LI Me and Kai doing donuts Quarter pound I roll up Bagging up the shake Show them passion from the gate I'm a bastard with an eighth Crew neck from sex fifth Cuzzle cop the black six Parking with his index finger Act like he mad rich I was on the block with a 50 pack and a bad bitch Sitting in the drop Lipstick was on some Mac shit Me I should have been dead, connect he live in Hempstead All I know is get the guap, Freaky told me get bread She think of nights I hated trapping Oreo 4's match the rate of jacket The life I live, you just can't imagine the way, so I'ma step up And do what I do, just do what I do I'm doing it for me, I'm doing it for you I do what I do, I just do what I do I just do what I do, I do it for the town I do it for the crew, I just do what I do I just do what I do, I just do what I do, I do, it for the I do it for the crew, I just do what I do 
that shit was crazy. How I got that? Um, so Dave, he's, he's popping right now. This dude, this kid named AR, he made beats. Mm -hmm. This is the whole story right here. I was on the way from another. I was on the, I was on the way home from another interview. And he was like, yo, you ever heard of this kid, Davies? I heard about him, but it wasn't like as much as he is like he he being heard about right now. So he just started to tell me like, yo, me and my boy, we used to we was making beats a couple years ago. We paid him for a fee, like for a verse to hop on one of our beats, but we never sent him the beat. So I'm like, yo, so you paid him, never sent him the beat. <laughs> I, I'm like, alright, so yeah, let, let him know. Like let him know who you're working with. Tell him. You know, I want to work with him. If we can make it happen, let's make it happen. And the next day, we was in the studio together. Had the video man come through, shot the video the same day. Just like that. Just like that. And we like, he linked up. We just chopping it up. It was real. You know? It was real. You real, nigga. Okay, Harlem. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Nah, it wasn't even a hassle. That was the best part. <laughs> was good, that was the best part about it. Like, it wasn't even a hassle. Like, I'm. I'm, I'm I'm happy that he was in Hollywood. You right. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cause I don't like I don't like when niggas do that. I don't, right. I don't get it. Unless you really Hollywood, you know what I'm saying? But if you niggas, you still in the hood, you ain't got no reason. I said because he's kind of still in the come. He got a, a crazy buzz, but he's still he ain't mainstream yet. Yeah. Yeah. Like he's still trying to come up. He so. out there. He in right. the mainstream. He, uh, he definitely he out there. Mainstream view. They can see him. Right. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? But it's only up from here. Yeah. You know, every, he, he just starting, just like a whole lot of people. We all we all just starting. If we ain't already there, we still starting. You know what I'm saying? You know, and that's a good thing he didn't move funny towards you. Because you know what my thing is? I feel like if you're going to move funny, funny shit going to come back towards you. Exactly. You know what I mean? When you do, like I said, when you do dirt, you, you, you get dirt. Yeah. You know, so, you know, he did the right thing by you. So, you know, his career uh, will prosper and, you know, he, he do him. Exactly. All right, so we're going to ask you, just like we asked the homeboy before. Um... What's your top five MCs? Top five MCs. Yes, no, on Long Island. Oh, yeah, first Long, on Long Island, Island first. Is this Long Island. Yeah. Long Island. From yeah. Long Island that I know of, I right. Definitely got Ra. Ra who? Ra. Rock and Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you talking about like people like around right now? Yeah, 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 right. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, let me let me let me see, let me think. Cause I don't know, I don't know everybody that's from Long Island that's doing it. You know what I'm saying? People that you know, who I, might, know. I might leave some people that right. you guys know. All right, so you got me, you got Reek, okay. you got hold up, me, Reek, you got John Jigs, you got who else is it? I'm trying to think. I don't know anybody else. All right, that's what I'm <laughs> You got the top three, no, don't matter. I don't know anybody else. Man. So who would you put on your top five of all time? Top Dead five. Dead or Alive. Dead or Alive, Jada. You got to go with Jada. I used to listen to Jada, man, all the time. I, even even still now, like, he never had a bad verse. Since you know what I'm saying? Like, never, Thank you. never heard a verse from Jada where you was like, nah, he that was trash. Never heard that. Never heard of that. Never. You know what I'm saying? That's, and he like the realest nigga. When you hear, when you, when somebody say Jada Kiss, the first thing that come to mind is, yo, his verses is real. Like, real. It's just always some real life shit. You just be still surprised about it. Like, how you say, how you say something that you and see like, every day. And you, I'm and, thankful that you said that. You know exactly. what I'm saying? Because it's because it's a person in here that doesn't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> I still won't put them on my top right. five, honestly. So these are the people that I listen to. Crazy. Jada, Lloyd Banks. Jada, Lloyd Banks. Um, I'm going to say 50. Because I used to listen to 50 Heavy. You know, um... We're gonna throw Ryan in because he's one of the top five, and we're gonna go with the last one, Nas. Okay. Nice. We got a few things, man. Nas is always on everybody's top five. Nas is nice. You know what I mean? Nas, Nas is definitely so well respected. Cheated. Well, I mean, <laughs> I think it's the way we framed oh, it because oh, oh, he came like, out. You don't like Taylor? Nah, I think he's nice, but I wouldn't put him in the top five. Who would you put in your top five? We're gonna flip. We already, we already did that, man. Yeah, you know what I mean? Karis one, I definitely got put down. Okay. You know, your, your godfather, Rakim, I always put down. Okay. You know, you probably don't know Raz Cass. I put him up there. You know what I mean? Um, who else I said? I said a few people, man. You know, I put Ghost up there. Ghost you know what I mean? Ghost Face Killer. And uh, Nas, you know what I mean? That's mm. what it is. You know? Okay. That's okay. just off the top. You but, put, um. Oh, snap. You talking about Ghost Face Killer? <laughs> 
Alright, man. So, Paul, give me that speech. You already know what it is, man. You're gonna have to edit that out. You already. We had some people come in here that you know they did their thing, uh, for the most part. And for the other percentage, we have people that came in. Here. Wait, did we have people come in and not do their thing? Everybody did their thing. Yeah, everybody did their thing. Yeah, yeah. Some that were better than others. Yeah, of course. Yeah, everybody did their thing. Wait, 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 wait. I'm undefeated. Um, I'm not sure what they. <laughs> I'm not sure what y'all record is. I'm not. I'm not. Y'all got some. I ain't got no losses. Uh, I ain't no losses. Nah, I don't think you do. <laughs> I don't think. Fill me in right now. I'm trying to fill me in. Nah, we were just like, you know, this is a freestyle session, so we just, like, we everybody from Long Island came through and ripped it. We had Bandcamp, Blackway came through and ripped it. We had well, Passport General, we just came through and ripped it. Mm -hmm. Who else know. we have from Long Island? Twan from uh, Wine Dance, right? Twan, mm -hmm. come on, Rachel. Rachel, here you go. Make sure that we Swap have. Boys, uh, come Swap on. Boys, Amityville. Kurt Kane and uh, all. Rick. Mm -hmm. Come do this thing. So we're just going to throw you a couple of instrumentals and you just. Alright, let's get it. Yeah. Look, DJ Var, King Myers, um, I tried for a long time not to even speak. On the way to this fuck boy say it for no reason. Maybe I'm just a problem. Maybe it's cause I'm out of rap game like the trap game. I'm the top side of Feel like I'm just a mile away. If the rap don't work, I'm taking John Gotti way. Nigga dead serious. Point blank, period. No if ands a bunch of shorty might leave you. If I put my finger in the butt, I need me a brain's truck. Not a Range Rover. You probably scared if you think the dope game over. Couple niggas from the hood, cocaine soldiers. If you ain't from here, don't come here with your blank show. We take that just to make a statement. You want your chain and your ring back, make a payment. Never was really playing when it came to the mic. Something happened in the dark, and the snitch niggas bring it to the light. Anybody who say it real gon' feel what I'm on. This rap shit, uh, it's still what I'm on. Hold on, hold on. Let me catch this beat, hold on. You know they hit my right hand. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You got that classic for you. Cause it's a lot going on. I know I'm different cause I get it. I go hard and my flow strong. A lot of times cats aim for the fame and miss. Little niggas with kids so you can blame the kiss. I'm speaking truthful. I know for being about it I'm crucial. I never try to lose cause winning is what I'm used to. Gang niggas, they rapping and getting signed But what happened in hip hop with a meaningful line This is a meaningful life I still treat it like my last day Got your bitch following it I don't wear act spray Hell on earth But I wonder what's halfway About to take off and burn them all like a drag race Moving fast pace, dying slow I'ma be real until the day I die and go I view myself as being real fly, you know Oh yeah, I'm watching the Hawaiian ho See, we need peace in this world, right? So how can paper be the reason that the world fight? We should have been something that the whole world like No disrespect, but the flag with the wrong strike I work hard, short days and long nights Nigga eat beats and I send them down the wrong pipe I said, niggas lie, so listen to what your girl say You gonna rock with me, do it the long way I'm a man Cause I look over my fam house The devil broke in, I fought him till he ran out So if it shines, you ain't gotta stick your hand out Cause I was told the quietest one stands out And that's me, nigga oh. You know, before we sign off, you gotta let the people know how to get you, baby Yo, everywhere, Real King Myers, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Real King Myers So what can we expect from King Myers in 2016? 2016 is going down. That's all you need to know, man. Uh, you see what I did in 2015. Mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's still more to do after that. Niggas think it's, it's over. You know what I'm saying? But I got my peoples in the building with me. CMG, Creative okay. Music Group, my boy Vito. We just came. You want to know where we just came from? And shouts out to them. We just came from the studio where EPMD recorded their albums. What? That's what's up. Right in their park. What's the name of the studio? Charlie. Uh, Charlie, Charlie. Shout out to my boy Charlie, Charlie man. I just Charlie, met him today. It's definitely a great connection, man. Shout out to my boy Tremont. Shout out to Vito. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Long Island, man. Legendary shit is happening right now, man. Mm -hmm. Seriously. It's, it's going down. History in the making, and we part of it right now. But we see any features with any other Long Islands? Any other Long Island artists? 
Um, definitely. That's the whole goal, man. That's what I want to do now. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm trying to bring the island together. I feel like. I feel like um. I feel like it's not like people people not trying to come together. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like everybody feel like they gotta be the best, but in order to I feel like in order to be the best, you gotta you gotta be out there. Like you gotta be connecting with everybody else who's saying that they the best. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, even if you not the best, or even if you are the best, like at the end of the day, you gotta work with niggas. So if we all from Long Island, how you repping Long Island and I'm repping Long Island, but we not connected. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like right. where where's the where's the gap at? Why is it a gap in Long Island and it's connected? I don't it's, get it's it. Cool. You're not the first person said that that come in here. Exactly. That came in here from Long Island. A lot of people I'm feel saying. like that. It's very common. Hopefully, you know, we can start bridging these gaps and um get people to network more, get more collabos done, like, you know. Do it the Long Island way, baby. Exactly, like how they used to do it back in the day. So All I gotta say is let's work. Long Island, anybody if anybody gonna hear this from Long Island that's that's making music that need to hear it. If you feel like you need to hear it, then you let then let's just hear it. But let's work. I don't care if you hate me for just for being nice. If you feel like you better than me, let's still work. At the end of the day, I don't give a fuck. I'm here to make music at the end of the day, man. So either you, we gonna work together. If I don't work with you, it ain't gonna stop me from working. Show <laughs> must go on, right? So it's, it must go on. Exactly. Nah, that's must go. Up. That's what's up, man. Yo, thanks for coming on. It was a pleasure. You did your numbers. You know what I mean? Always, man. Yo, I appreciate you guys for reaching out. Man. I definitely. I appreciate about. you for reaching out. You know what I'm saying? Yo, because most of the time I only get to, I only, I only chat back and forth with people over the phone, like mm. texting or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. I appreciate phone calls. You know what I'm saying? Nah, that's, that's the real. You know, that's me, me, and, me and my cousin right here, like, yo, we gotta get something on. You know, exactly. but we definitely uh, like what we saw and um, when, and how y'all hear movements and we like, yo, we was like, yo. You gotta get them on, right, B? Yes, I do. Definitely, and I'm gonna be back. This is Hot 97, right here, right in Long Island. You know what I'm saying? Let them know, man. Let the people know. Because they're out here fucking around. It's Yak Radio. Shout out in the loop. We are definitely in the loop, Long Island. We've been in the loop. Let's keep the loop looping. Exactly. You already know. Introduce one more track. This is Make a Flip, y'all. I think I, I think this gonna be the next single, man. Make a Flip. Kingology dropping January 15th. Started getting hot, so we had to. I've been on some different shit, but I'm still the same nigga. Yeah, trying to take trips, cruising in the eight wheeler on tour, picking up all the change, nigga. Trying to stay away from strange niggas. The top ain't too far, I don't stop, I go hard. What? Trying to vacate with no top on the car, fly over the hood, straight to another place. It could be far away, or it could be the next state. We about to eat good, good food on our plates. We about to be stars, like when you look in the space. I'm serious, nigga, just take a look at my face. I had a dream that I stood on the rape. Let the beard drop like I'm from Philly, but they know I'm 